there is a very important quote of Walt Disney. We have to do more than we have to talk about. This is especially stuck towards the NEP. We are not talking about in the higher education system. We have implemented in the primary education only. This is the my concept of the evaluation. I have divided in the four classes. First the lower, second the primary, third is secondary, and fourth is the higher education. In the first level, we have to uh, only the concept of place food should be followed. In primary education, it should be more theory based to develop the learning capacity and in the secondary education it should be the practical way. The higher education should develop the problem solving capacity in the student. And the last is the life where they should implement their higher education on the ground level experience. Third, there is a comparison. The third point in the old education system is the most important one. It does not provide the experience to provide the experience of the newer technologies. Yeah, and the, uh, 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 that there is a gain in artificial intelligence for that the artificial intelligence is quite flexible for the changes of the and their adaptation. AI. Why we are needing AI? There are four major, major concepts behind it. It's responsive. It's very rapid in response. Second is the decision, third is the adaptive and fourth is the independent. It, and last, we need, we need an executive plan by the government. Second, it should have the negative impact. We have to consider them first that before implement the AI in the field. Third, we have to develop a common line of interest between today's generation and the most advanced AI. Thank you. We have a logical analysis the constraint and then we have given a solution for the whole system of the system. Any questions from the chat? Thank you. Thank you, Adhavendra. Next we have with us Sharon Divya from CXC Telangana. Okay. 
carbon dioxide and releases oxygen which is equal to half of the atmospheric oxygen so how to determine uh, make it and monitor the phytoplankton blooms because uh, phytoplankton blooms has the direct impact on fisheries uh, by using ocean color we are going to detect the phytoplankton here ocean color refers to regulatory measurements of either water leaving regions or remote sensing measurements from satellite mounted thermometers. So the wavelengths present in the visible light uh, is the technology used to detect the uh, detect and monitor phytoplankton. The sun, uh, radiation from the sunlight which coming contact with the ocean water surface and get detected back. Those detected uh, radiations are captured through the satellite. And the weather is quite a pattern or any set other segments of or any others. Why do phytoplankton and other constituents change the color of water? First year phytoplankton has a pigment called chlorophyll A, which observes blue, blue light and reflects green light. And other constituents like non-other factors, color, dissolved organic matter will also be present. So ocean color and signature of climate change. Why? Because First thing to monitor the changes in marine phytoplankton. We all know that phytoplankton is the base or the foundation for marine food chain. And it also it is also crucial for uh, carbon cycle. So by the presence of chlorophyll A, can, it is visible, so the green color is visible, right? So that property we are using. Then ocean sector is slow spacecraft ocean side too. Provide ocean color monitoring with coverage of applications such as sea state forecast, monsoon and cyclone forecast, fisheries and climate production estimation, detection and monitoring of phytoplankton blooms. This is the topic that we are discussing now. Study of stairs, sediment dynamics. So this technology, the remote sensing technology of satellites is used in fisheries planning and operations considering the effects of climate change. So to understand the principle of ocean color, we use a mobile application called Hydro Color. So this is the logo. You go to Play Store and type Hydro Color, install this app. What we have to do is, there is three, image, three images are there. Gray card, sky and uh, the water. You have to capture the pictures of these three. So when you open that application, this is the first picture. It will be displayed on the screen. Go and click on the gray card. Take the pick of the gray card. So while taking the picture, there is a procedure to follow that in the second picture, there is a green color bar, bar line that should come in between two rectangles or two triangles. So at that angle, you have to capture the gray, uh, picture of gray card, sky and water. Water is the natural water body that we have going to test. So here, that I, this hydro color app uses the uh, advantage of internal GPS gyroscope and uh, the clock and the compass also. So after we submit the pictures, it will display a data sheet which gives the date, time, turbidity and reflectance. Uh, reflectance. So by using this data, we can analyze and by knowing the turbidity, we can know whether uh, uh, we have to plan the, what type of fishing operations or fishing, fish planning activities can be done. So, uh, this can be helpful for the fisherman on their uh, some uh, functions. Uh, this is the website I have, right? Okay. This is the confusion because otherwise we consider this a way for... They have given an explanation teaching uh, using astronomy's perspective. That's fine. Yeah. So, the way you thought we consider as such a general teaching, correct? Right? Thank you. Uh, any other questions? Thank you, Neha. Next is Aarti Rajput from Kor Chhattisgarh.
that is the major disadvantage of chatbot. Right? If I am right, I don't know about the much about this artificial intelligence and uh, chatbot system. And that is the actually one has to teach conceptual education. You are the IIT top rankers also failing in the third year of bachelor students. Why? Right? Because they will give the objective type of examination, they will give the ABCDs, but they will answer, they will mug at the After joining in the IITs, majority people are failing and majority people are dropping off in the middle of IITs also. Because they are lacking of how to implement the knowledge to the, to the utmost level. That is my way of uh, teaching methods. Any suggestions required? I will talk. Just I will tell you the why we have taken the system because you know that uh, we are going to pass a big trend in the education system about teaching and learning. You know that today at ICR there is the international conference on blended learning that is going on. Because we have to pass a lot of changes in the future. For example, you know that everybody is talking that our 70% of the students from the rural background now the concept of rural background or urban background is going to be changed. The background will not affect the education, education for all. And how? Because everybody wants that we want to go abroad for teaching. That type of person we are having. <coughs> Means how long we will go on thinking that teaching that learning from a foreign university is good? Why? What is the way? What? Which way we are less than any other country? So that concept of boundary based teaching is going to be finished because all the university everything, you know, the students can participate or student can register in any the best university of the world, nobody can stop you. Because you you, you will register the best course available in the, any university that you like. That type of teaching is coming. You can uh, get it registered in a foreign university, the foreign uh, students also can register in our university. So there will be a competition that is self-reliance of the universities. So there we will develop their own courses. So the type of students flow will decide the revenue. So these things will be in place in the new education policy. So for that thing, we thought that when the students are who are the real, uh, if you think that this system is not good, you can say that the present students are the victim. So let's listen from them. What type of teaching they want. That's why we wanted to know. It's not that going to evaluate that all the things of equal, summarize all the things. It is common that skill oriented teaching should be there. That means what type of teaching we are giving uh, that uh, they are unable to come with a solution. Means they should come forward for a solution best. Anything, any problem will be there. Our students should be ready for a solution. So that type of teaching should be there. Then obviously that uh, technology best teaching should be there. Even you want or not, but this will be in place in coming five years. All the technology should be there. The level of the use of technology will be different based on the hour to what extent you can adopt it. So artificial intelligence, all the gadgets will be used. Now question comes that uh, what will be the constraint or limitations? Obviously. A country like India, we cannot afford in a one year or two years, it will take its own time. That's why implementation of new education policy, government has given a time frame of 2030. And complete education policy will be 2040. So that's why that time, uh, time span is given. So we are having an incubation period till which we can think of how best we can implement all these things so that we will be at par with others. Otherwise, we will be like that. The foreign university will be open to uh, uh, their outreach center will be in India. The best university, the outreach center will be in India. So that the best students are, they may go to that university. So those students which will be uh, not able to compete, compete, so they may they may not get a good university. So that type of things will be in place. So we should prepare that what type of uh, syllabus we should select how we will select, what type of career that we will make, that all depends. Tomorrow, that is, you know, the 65% of our population in India is youth only. So, government wants that entrepreneurship should be promoted. Entrepreneurship means that you will 
in your career suppose you want that i want to be um, entrepreneur let me give you an example of field mill suppose you want to develop a field mill you are a accountant fishery uh, owner so when you are having money you are investing the money for the don't feed for the fish the same thing with little variation of the with the same investment you can also produce feed for animal poultry and uh, cattle but you need a cost to lead but in present system our there is a boundary if you are taking animal and fisheries you cannot take any cost in animal yes and now this new education also allow you you can take any cost either in the this animal science or agriculture that you think that by taking that cost it will help you for developing your entrepreneurship so this type of things are coming in future and coming 25 years this will be very challenging for us and we will lead it that's why we wanted to know what type of teaching should be so that this will be our prepared us from today and we are going to implement in the future so what you give all the suggestions we will be that uh, we will compile it and uh, you know that tomorrow we are having a session for the, with the deans same thing we will be discussed tomorrow so that finally we will come out some things ICER is also ICER has also given the guidelines how to implement new education policy so same thing we will see that how best we will make a balance because in india we cannot implement the new education is so complicated so means that is budget uh, intensive it will be that's why they have given a time so we will see that how best we can make this educational systems in the education more liberty more autonomy oriented in the future that is the reason why we have taken so thank you students for giving a very good suggestions they will compile it only thing that i feel the some of there are some confusion so some only because there was a topic was given there is next there is some teaching and that theme was listing so that's why for five students they have made a presentation on climate change though we have a separate climate change uh, session there is a model display there but anyway we got what type of information report in the of the students that will take care thank you very much thank you very much sir for the closing remarks now uh, the day is arranged near the canteen the student representatives can guide the students towards canteen and after uh, 10 minutes we will reassemble here for the student interaction session followed by the prize distribution and that day.